So just a couple of days ago, Neverrealm showed us that Natara is Megan Fox. Today, they're showing us Jean-Claude Van Damme as Johnny Cage. So let's have a look what's going on. And then I'll go over it again, see if I can spot anything new. But let's just have a, let's have a peek, see what's going on. I finally meet Hollywood Boulevard Johnny. Fans love me. Do you know what they'll pay for selfies? Fight. Hey, that shows the real Johnny stuff. I told you Madame Bo would be a tough negotiator. Yeah, I wish she was my agent. Oh, that was some sweaty neutral though. That's an ex Scorpions is an ambush. Oh, uh, Scorpions are gonna assist. Give up a card into that. It will be great. I'll be a kickboxer, you a street fighter. The answer is still no. This has got to be new, isn't it? Or is it? Yeah, it's new. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty sick. Alright. Oh, you need premium edition for it as well. Alright, so first things first, right, if you didn't know the relevance of John Claude Van Damme to Mortal Kombat, this whole franchise exists because of him. If you go, if you don't you know your Mortal Kombat lore, like a nerd, like I do, um, Ed Boon made the image of the film off of Bloodsport. Obviously, there's other films in there, like Bruce Lee's Enter the Dragons, obviously quite inspirational to it. Like, it's a lot of it's tied in, but Bloodsport was the one that they uh, did. Mortal Kombat off of Jean Claude was meant to be Johnny Cage in the first place, so it's like everything's come full circle, you know. Like the first game exists because of Jean Claude Van Damme, but he's never been in the game. Now he is, so that's pretty cool. I think that's more of a that's a thing for Never Realm, isn't it? Like rather than the greater fan base, I don't think the greater fan base will be as like hyped up about it. It's cool. It is cool. But I think the Megan Fox edition was cooler still. Alright, so now there's a couple of things that I picked up in there that I didn't notice. I don't know if maybe some of, some of you figured it out before, but I didn't notice this already. So let's have a look. Right. They're doing sweaty combos and all that. This, I think it was here. He does this. The uppercuts, right? And then the Scorpion appears and does a fireball. Scorpion's an ambush assist, that means. I didn't really pay attention to that every other time I saw Scorpion assist. But because he's an ambush, and he looks like he's a combo extender, maybe even a combo starter, Scorpion's going to be a good assist. I think just ambush is a good assist in general. I don't know if this is a high or not. Let's have a look. Yeah, that's probably a high. But... That's going to give a lot of characters extensions. You're going to be able to do down to, like you just did, down to Scorpion. Oh my god, they're going to be doing down to... It's going to be Scorpion, Scorpion. All right, Scorpion playing Scorpion assist. And they're going to be mashing down to Scorpion. That's what's going to be the thing. And Death Spin, that's what they're going to do. Calling it now, day one, that's what you're going to see. Scorpion, Scorpion, down to Scorpion, Death Spin. They will be punished for this. Yeah, then he does not punch, restands him. Then he gets a grip. 
It will be great. I'll be a kickboxer, you a street fighter. The answer is still no. Wait, was he was he a kickboxer? I can't even remember. Or whatever. What was the other thing? It's fatal. Yeah. That looks like a little throwback to Cassie. Cassie did that exact same like start up of her fatal in the last game. Hey, I didn't realize it's the first time. If you listen to this, this is the sound of uh, what is it? It's it's one of the actual Mortal Kombat One soundtracks he's playing in his car. I'm gonna by the time I post this video, I'll find out what it is. But you can post in the comments what one it is because you know what I'm talking about. Is it the pit or something? Is it the pit? I don't know. Then yeah, he's got Dan Ford and Toasty, and then he yeah blows him up. Blah blah blah. Ah, that's cool. That's cool. Yeah, yeah I'll, I'll give it a thumbs up. Available in stores and digitally beginning September the fourteenth. So we're what? We're only six days off. Six long, drawn-out days, but yes, yeah, it's, it's getting close, isn't it? So, so yeah, basically, Mortal Kombat are getting a lot of celebrities in, aren't they? Or even over the last few of them, actually, like um, got Arnie, well, Arnie's likeness, Stallone, Megan Fox, John Cena, Van Damme. I'm sure, I'm missing someone. It was probably more. Uh, what's it? Peter Peter Weller as Robocop. I mean, we're playing. We're basically playing celebrity deathmatch. The game at this point, it's like Mortal Kombat slash celebrity deathmatch. But that's cool. I mean, they've got they're backed by Warner Brothers. So they can pretty much do whatever they, they want at this point. They could probably just branch out and make celebrity deathmatch fight of the game at this point. But yeah, Van Dam looks cool. Games around the corner needs to hurry up. Videos over.